Hi everyone, we're Ramba, and today we're reviewing Alzan Yunar. Yunsar. Yunsar. I still don't know how to pronounce her name. I think it's Alzan. But Alzan? I, I don't know. Okay, Alzan. We'll say Alzan. So this is her, and she is a brawler. And she... Her dress is really pretty. Yeah. It's, it's flary. It is. And it looks like it has, like, chin- tassels. Chinkly. Not chinkly. <laughs> Tassels! Tassels! It has. It looks like it will make noises, like when you walk. Yeah. Clink clink. It's nice. Um, she is a plus, plus. on Famitsu and a seven out of ten on Game With. Mm-hmm. So she is a brawler, and she is a shinky version of the previous one. So because her of stats that, are uh, much better than her previous one. Although right now I do think that they are. Fairly standard stats. For brawlers at this point in time. So this is her art. It is also quite fan service-y. I feel like also the art is a little bit old styled. Yeah. So. I'm not a big fan of this art per se. Neither am I. Yeah, so her leader skill is unflappable monarch. monarch. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's correct. What does that even mean? Unflappable is like when, when... I think it's kind of like the idea where you're unfazed, you know what okay. I mean? I think unflappable actually is a word, but I'm not 100% sure. We should look that up later. Um, so what it does is uh, damage taken by brawlers lowers markedly, markedly. Wow, that's a hard word to say. So as you can see, compared to the Lancer Elzon, which we recently reviewed, she also has a lot of SP capabilities. So mm-hmm. this one has SP plus 15%. And yet another SP plus 15%. Which stacks out to be SP plus 30%. Um, although this one does not have the SP cost minus 20%. It's just resist damage minus 20%. So, standard with all Shinkis, her action skills are both reborn. Her first action skill is Reborn Mega Flame Knuckle. It will cost you 28 SP, and it's basically a string of attacks with fire-covered fists. Right, so it does fire damage, as you may expect. Her second skill is called Reborn Volcano. It will cost uh, 35 SP, and to read the action skill, it rushes in and pulverizes the enemy while causing an explosion dealing fire damage. In addition, it will temporarily raise the user's attack speed. So it is still another string of fiery fists with a little smaller... Small radius of AoE. And then on top of that, it gives you a buff of attack speed. Which is really nice, I think, for Brawlers, just because they already attack relatively quickly, so adding a little bit more would make them, like, regain SP really quickly, so you can use her action skills again, so... But yeah. Let's try her out. So we are now in the standard stage of ours. And so let us try out her first action skill. It is... A lot of swipes. And it moves forward. Which is nice, I think. Yeah, so it does a decent amount of damage. It is... Auto-targeting. Auto-targeting. It's really pretty, actually, I have to say. Because, like, the end, like, attack... Like, okay, I know a lot of the old characters, they have, like, the attack swipey like that. But, like, they kind of swipe, 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 and it kind of just ends. Where this one ends with, like, a bang. Yeah. So here is her second action skill. So, wow, okay... We slightly misspoke. misspoke earlier, but it's sort of like a rocket. Rock. It's like a soaring fist. Something. It's basically it goes straight towards the uh, enemy, and, and then, then she jumps up and does the AOE on does the ground. Does a final like kill, and it does have the action, not action, speed. attack speed buff. It does have an attack speed buff, and you can see it now as a faster brawler attack. Mm-hmm. I imagine that means it's a 50% buff, probably? Probably. Probably a 50% buff. Um, and so right now I do have the charge from the brawler from killing, or I think it, it's from attacking a certain amount of times. But if I use the skill, you can see that it does do a good amount of fire damage. Right. Uh, it does twice as much from the first skill, actually, it looks like. Because with the second skill, each hit does about 100, and I think the last hit does 500. Mm-hmm. 
It's really nice, um, because she, you can spam her skills like mad, too. Yeah, so she is like the Lancer version, in which you can spam very easily. Um, I'm not going to survive. Yeah. Yeah, that's pretty nice. Um, she is very similar to her Lancer version. That being said, I feel like then, in either case, you can have her or her Lancer version and still be equally happy with them. Yeah, so with both the Brawler version and the Lancer version, they are both very spammable. Mm -hmm. And they are both quite tanky, just because Lancers themselves are king. Horrendously tanky. Lancers are like legitimately advertised as the tank of the team. And then the Sprawler version does have high like HP, HP and also the resist damage um, passive. Mm-hmm. She's on par with a lot of the Brawlers out there right now, so I would imagine that if you really want to Shinky her, you should, if you have any particular like feelings for Alzan. That being said, I think Brawlers nowadays are much better than her. Um, yeah, I'm not terribly impressed with her Shinky. Main- I think it's because... All of her, like, equivalent brawlers are just so good. Like, her equivalent brawlers are just so OP that her Shinky kind of pales in comparison. I mean, my in the current batch, batch is not that great. very good. But say, like, Ozma, and then, like, although his damage is not very good, Ozma's shining ability is basically his shock is so prevalent that it... It shocks basically everything. So, I mean, if you have her and you want a brawler and you have particular feelings for her, I would say Shinky her. If you don't, if you're just looking for a brawler in general, I feel like rolling for a new batch might be more worth it just because Shinkies are so expensive. If Shinkies were any cheaper, I would say, yeah, let's do it. But like, holy moly, Shinkies are so expensive. But yeah, that is Alzon the brawler. Mm-hmm. Thanks for watching today and we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.